this is. I don't either, right? So that's what makes it funny. <laughs> I couldn't even, I don't even. Okay, well, stop thinking about it because we're going to do like. Hey everyone, today we're going to do something really fun. We're going to do a collaboration with I Am Lise. It's a funny collaboration where we are going to guess what Australian slang words mean. And I think there's going to be other YouTubers involved too, so we'll put all the links in the description below so you can make sure to check out everyone else's responses because it should be pretty funny. Yeah. Okay, so you go first. Uh, <laughs> so the first word you need to give a definition for is chunder. Chunder? Yeah. Chunder down under? Oh, I wonder what's in the chunder. <laughs> I really don't want to. Chunder. Um, I'm just rhyming words with chunder. Is it like an action or something? Part, part, of, me, guess? part of me thinks it's like chugging, like, like maybe something people would use like like, like they're drinking. Yeah, like they're drinking if they're out. Like chunder. Oh, like chunder that beer or something like that. Hey, mate. Chunder that chunder that beer. That's my best guess. I, I don't I don't know. I don't have a guess. <laughs> oh, actually, I have a guess for this one. Well, you want to tell me what it is? Okay, so this next one is chuck a sicky. Uh -huh. Does it mean vomit? That like was my sick? guess as well. That was my guess. As Are we well. right? Chuck a sicky. Yeah. Bludger. See, you say bludger, and all I think of is Quidditch from Harry Potter. I think it's the ball that moves on its own and just tries to beat the crap out of everybody. Oh, I guess that would make sense because when I thought of Bledger, I thought of like, like murdering you, someone. You hit someone, or maybe like a bully who hits people all the time is a Bledger, like someone who goes around just beating people up. One of those two things is my guess. I agree with that. Okay, next one is Dag. Hey, Dag. No. What's up, Dag? See, my. Like, my, bro? My, like, bra? Maybe. I have no idea. See, my my guess is it's like it's like their word for dog. Like like uh, British people and even a lot of Canadian people say mum instead of mom. Part of me oh, says like it's a like dag? it's dog. like it's with an accent. Yeah, dog. But it's a oh, dag. that's a dag over there. Yeah, something like that. That's that's my guess. But I I could be completely. It's supposed to be slang and right. not not. Not accent. Like, not an accent, so I could be. I don't think wrong. it's spelled phonetically, like a different. It's not one word and it's spelled phonetically the way that it sounds. Well, mom is spelled M U M, not M O M. Touche. Touche. So. Okay, maybe. Dog. Thanks for coming. What up, bra? What up, dag? My turn. Oh, okay. This room is chock full? Like chock full? I can see that. Like it's like crowded? Like we went to the restaurant and it was chocker, so we went somewhere else? Yeah. I think that's what it is. That's, that's a good guess. I can't even <laughs> say this one. Uvalaki. Oh, Duvalaki. Duvalaki. I'm beginning to wonder if some of these are fake. <laughs> Duvalaki. I feel like it has a to- A stupid person? Like a dunce? Maybe. Oh, maybe it's one of those like soror or sororities and frats where the- they have to, they do all those things, those... Like the rush? Yeah, the rush. And maybe one of the people, they call them Duvalaki. Maybe. It could be a title. You do the lackey. I feel like it would almost have to be a title of like a type of person. Because <laughs> most slang that's used for other words is a shorter version. Like to, to make it, to make it easier and faster You're to say. So you're really analyzing these. I things. am really analyzing these. Yeah, it's the way my brain works. I'm, it's I'm like crazy. breaking you down. I'm crazy like this. <laughs> Arvo. Ardbark? I feel like people don't say Ardbark enough to have I know. slang. Board. I know. They guys have Ardbarks. <laughs> if you have Arvo. Ardbarks running around I'm like we have raccoons, I then maybe. I just said the most similar word I could think of. Okay, Arvo. I feel like an Arvo might be like a type of vehicle for some reason. You I would think that <laughs> well, cars. I am obsessed with cars. I'm obsessed with vehicles. Like we call Chevrolet Chevy? Yeah, or maybe it's like maybe it's like like 
I don't know. Or a like, type of car? Like a moped or something like that. That's my right? guess. Mm-hmm. It's a vehicle. Arvo. Vehicle. Okay. Sook. S-O-O-K. Sook. Sook. I've got nothing. Is it like their version of sick? Like, it'd be like, oh, that's sick. That's awesome. Oh, that's sick. maybe. Yeah, I could see that. Maybe. That's so sick. That's my guess. But <laughs> that haircut is sick. Yeah. <laughs> I have a squiz. Oh, I'm gonna guess that's a soda. Yeah, I could see that being a soda. Is a squiz like... a soda? Yeah, that's that's a good. That's a good. Have a squiz. Guess. A squiz. Have a soda. It is. Dax. Well, there's Dax and then Dacking, so. Yeah. I don't know if they're related. I'm assuming they are. You're, not, you're generally not gonna have words that close. Dax is D A C K S and Dacking is D A C K I N G. So it's something that can be an action and a thing. There's our deductive reasoning right here. Oh, yeah, well, I mm-hmm. Anyways, Dax. This this thing is really buggy. I can't put it. I don't know why. But my brain wants to say Dax is like an item of clothing or an item of like a, a, a something like that. And Are you really like Dockers? No, I'm thinking like Dax is like hiking boots and Dacking is like go hiking. Hey, that's a good. So like you know it's like like, like these, yeah. I just learned what wellies were. Yeah. And they're Wellington boots, and here it's just rain boots. <laughs> Yeah. I was so confused. So I have a feeling Dax and Dacking, like, I feel like... Like hiking boots? Or yeah, I feel like it's a, it's a, it's a, it's something you wear, and then Dacking is something brand. that, I think Dacking is something that you, that re, is something you do that requires whatever that is. So my guess is like hiking boots, but you would only wear hiking boots if you were going you hiking. hiking. I mean, I don't know I why like my brain just came up with that. Like a parachute and skydiving? Maybe. You know that like flying squirrel thing? That would be cool. I would never jump out of a perfectly good airplane, but I do think that is really fun to watch. Spit the dummy. Spit the dummy? Oh, I know what that is. I know what that is. What is it? I think I know what that is. Because a dummy in other countries is a pacifier. So if the baby spit out the dummy, he spit out the pacifier. Oh, okay. Maybe? That's a, that's, I mean, it makes sense. Okay. Totally oh, thinking mommy brain here. No, yeah, that makes sense. I don't know why you call a pacifier a dummy. Because it's a... No. Oh, I get it. Yeah, <laughs> I got it. It's fake. Yeah, uh-huh. Enough explanation. Um, rat bag. Oh, that's just gotta be a derogatory term. Rat bag is actually, or was used in America for a while. I don't know if it's used too much like anymore. Like in the 50s? I think it was back in the day, when they had, like, which was a Wednesday, by the way. Stuff. Yeah, uh, like rat bags. Uh, yeah, so it's a, it's a. Oh, yeah, the mob is still real. <laughs> it's just, it's a derogatory term for a person. Um, I think back when it was used commonly here, it was associated with people who were they considered rats, and they would like uh, tell the other people secrets. The snitch. Yeah. Okay. Esky. H to the S E S K. No. <laughs> He's American. But yeah. <laughs> She's talking about Husky Starcraft. Jesus. Er, he introduces all of his videos saying that he's H to the Usky Husky. Oh, H to the Usky Husky. Yeah. And, and this is Esky, not H- not Usky. Yeah. Esky. Esky. That's sketchy. That's S-E. I can see that. Sketchy. Like sketchy. Shady, like, like you don't want to go there. Yeah. That's S-E. Or like potentially dangerous. Like sketchy. Like. At least you're gonna tell us what these actual answers are, right? I hope so. <laughs> no, we're just gonna have to read our comments of everyone just laughing at us. <laughs> it's fine. Actually, any Australian viewers, I you comment say. below yeah, and tell us, us if we got what? any right, and tell us how horribly we got most of them. <laughs> dirty. Dirty. For some reason, my brain immediately looks like a dirty diaper. By the way, you get to do the next one. <laughs> she cracked onto him. It has to mean she's hitting on him. 
Uh, like she went over and started talking to him. Or did, yeah. I can see that. Mm-hmm. A patch. Patch it? Maybe like, it's that's a my kiss. Patch. Oh, that's a cute idea. Because, like, passion and kiss. Yeah. That's my guess. It's a kiss. I will go with that one. Crook? Crook? I mean... That's just a... Criminal. Criminal, right? Yeah. Crook in America is a criminal. You're a crook. You... What if it's like a cooking utensil there? Who knows? It could it be. It probably is. I'm going to guess cooking utensil. All right. And I'm, you're going to guess I'm going criminal. with the English. A lot of times it's more used for, like... Salesman is a crook. Like he, he like gives you a bad deal. He's a crook. Not so much like he robbed a bank. But the next one is bog. Oh, I'm I... gonna guess a car for this one, like a vehicle. Bog. I've heard that word a bog. I don't know what it is, but my guess is it's a noun. It's a person, place, or thing. And I think it's an old vehicle. Okay, we'll go with that. I guess a bog. Because I mean, like I said, I I think it's a noun. Um, that's pretty. Pretty basic. You say it's a vehicle. We'll go with that. Whoop 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 whoop. Who says that? I don't know. That seems very awkward to say. Whoop whoop. Yeah. It doesn't sound like it would flow very well in normal conversation. <laughs> You'll have to give us an example of that one in the comments below. Yeah, you go down to the train track. You take the whoop whoop and you. <laughs> you no, know, I mean. No wonder Australians are so happy. They're just constantly like <laughs> laughing at each other while they're talking. You sound ridiculous. <laughs> but in all reality, Australia does seem great from everything else. I love since. watching Australian videos because yeah. I get to listen to their accents. Yeah. And like I said, I used oh, to watch... and I have my GPS set to an Australian guy. <laughs> yeah. If too bad Sunnies should... isn't on here. Sunnies. That's sunglasses. I've learned that. Don't forget your Sunnies. Don't let the seagulls steal your chips. Yeah. Your fries? Fries, I think. Fries chips or chips fries? or fries? We're adding to your list here. <laughs> I don't know what womp womp is. I don't. Whoop whoop. Whoop whoop womp womp. Oh no, there's no M. Whoop whoop. I have no idea. The hanky panky? Oh, like make, <laughs> like make whoopee? Yeah. That's the only thing, and that's because I thought of whoopee. Yeah. That's Maybe. the only thing I can think of. That's a very seldom used slang in America is whoopee, like we're making whoopee for making love. So possibly. It kind of sounds like it goes with the next one. Shonky? Shonky. Yeah. I don't, I mean, I, there's no, I have no basis for any of this. Oh, this sounds interesting. Where he but it sounds, this. it definitely sounds to me like it could be an adult activity. Shonky? I could just, like, in, like an action, perhaps? I don't know. I, I really have no idea. Shonky. That's, that's my best Shonky. guess, because um, that's... Wonky? Yeah. See, again, going with, like, what it sounds like. And wonky in America is, like, a little off. Like, your wheel's like doing cricket. this. Yeah, like, if your wheel's doing this as it goes down the road, your wheel's wonky. Cars. <laughs> yeah, I relate everything to cars I was thinking wonky, like, if something's, like, hanging on the wall and it's, like, cricket or something. She wants to do interior design? I'm obsessed with cars. Can you tell? <laughs> I think that's all of them. Yeah, that's it. That's the whole list. Yeah. Pick one of them that you really want to know. We'll have them all guess. Um, Esky. Yeah, what is Esky? E S K Y. Alright, just let us know your guesses down in the comments below. Yeah, this is this is really bad. Well, um, I look forward to finding out what they actually mean. And if you enjoyed this video and would like to see more of things like this, let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more of us. Hit the like button and don't forget to leave all the comments down below that we've been asking for. Don't forget your sunnings and don't let the seagulls steal your chips, as her GPS always says. <laughs> I was gonna end with that. <laughs> you stole my line. Yeah. Don't forget the links down below for everyone else who's involved. And uh, from the person who I am Isky, or no. <laughs> wow, I got the words. I hope that's not a derogatory thing. I am Lise. I am Lise. <laughs> And who gave us these words, and then everyone else who's going to be guessing as well in the, in the description below. I think the kid is awake, by the way. Yeah, we need to, uh, yeah, we definitely uh, look him up. 
Daddy, there's a dirty for you. <laughs> and there's a little card. It says Megan on it with a smiley face. Oh, I'm so excited. note. Hello fall. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Pumpkin spice everything. Best time of the year. Megan, happy fall. I'm so excited to do this.